yeah, that's okay. So probably smaller it will be like better. So I'm going to space them a little bit more again. So the steps probably 45. So now here and there a little bit more spaced. Yes. So now the bullet it's a little bit fast. Okay, so I don't want the bullet to be that fast. Fine to make it more difficult. So and also the speed. We're going to change the speed. Every time we collide with this guy, we're going to increase the speed little by little. Okay? So and to screen, to increase the speed, we are going to reduce the seconds that we want uh, these insects to move. For example, if we are moving in less time, okay, so we will be like more uh, we will have faster insects. Okay, so we have to reduce that value. So for example, when I touch this uh, edge the right edge so I want to reduce this thing okay but I want to reduce this value when I broadcast go down so I broadcast go down I go to the insects and they receive go down so and we want to change this value we want to change the speed a little bit so what to do okay well the speed I mean the seconds okay well to do that probably we can just uh, change every time we collide with these friends we go for data my seconds we're going to set my seconds okay we're going to set my seconds uh, no, we're going to change my seconds. Sorry, sorry. We're going to change my seconds. Minus point zero uh, two. Okay. Or five. That it's like reducing this like five percent. Okay. So I will do the same for the other um, here is the bullet oh no 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 sorry I thought I was touching an edge so don't worry so it's right edge we are going to touch this and every time we have this thing when we send this uh, down we are going to change the seconds and reduce this value then we go to the left and we do the same we are going to reduce this value when we receive uh, this uh, variable okay so I receive go down I change no you know what it's forever yeah probably yes it's gonna work over there so this is going to do when it's receiving when I receive hmm no guys you know what we're going to insert this in here yes it's better sorry sorry I'm still learning a lot okay so now let's see what it's going to happen so we need to see this uh, speed thing or I mean the seconds so you have the seconds over there so let's play it let's press and let's wait if this is going to be like reducing every time we touch yes and it's going to be faster and faster and faster every time that thing touches the edges that's it moves faster a little bit faster if you check it's a little bit we can increase this value here and got it here to minus point zero nine That's it. I guess that's okay. 
so probably to make it more interesting minus point one and minus point one minus point one that's it we click the spacebar wait then we see this 0 0.9, 0 0.8, 0 0.7, 0 0.6 but of course there is thing that you need to know we don't want to the speed to get less than zero okay so in that case to avoid that we are going to add a condition so we are going to say if okay in this case well the seconds if the seconds operators are if the seconds are less I guess in this case point point twenty five okay if the seconds are bigger sorry or more than point twenty five zero point twenty five so we want to change this thing okay so we duplicate this one we delete the extra and we change the seconds okay if we have this value sorry I say bigger oh again again so if we have this value bigger than 0.25 seconds then I want to do that to reduce this thing okay to reduce to reduce and we are going to reduce by uh, 25 else we are going to set this variable again we are going to set the variable to 0 0.25 I guess 0 0.30 that's okay so and we are going to insert this procedure over here so we just remove this one my seconds and we're going to insert here then broadcast and that's it check so then we duplicate this one because we are going to use it we delete these ones and we're going to insert them in the other side so I delete because I copy I go to the other edge and I'm going to uh, delete this one and I'm going to add this one here so I have to check the speed and I guess that's okay so and then we just press we check if this is reducing I'm we're almost done with this tutorial guys so check this faster because I increase just this the reducing speed or the subtracting speed but it cannot get more than minus 25 uh, I mean minus 30 minus 25 yeah that's the maximum speed and I guess that's all for today so if you check here you have the game and this was my first tutorial of course it's pretty simple and I hope you like it and you have everything I use all the resources oh it's very fast it's because speed got to this oh that's good it's good to know what happens with this okay so well you have to try it ah because I didn't change this else set my seconds sorry that's why you need to check your variables my seconds my seconds and then I go to the other guy my seconds so that thing will work oh sorry I didn't press this I cheated okay let's see they cannot go less than that thing mm. well it's reducing this value that's why 
wait to reduce this to 0 0.15 to make it faster so it's because we have this value so let's keep this value to minus 20 so let's set it to 40 Point forty. Then we just try it. Okay. Yes, that's okay. Well, I hope you find useful this tutorial for App Inventor. Uh, I mean, for Scratch, you know, App Inventor, okay? So it is my first tutorial about this, okay? I, was, I am really entertained, okay? And I also like because the my son likes to work with this thing, okay? Well, we just started, okay? And sometimes we work together. And it's a pretty nice activity if you have children, okay? I recommend you work with them, okay? And try to make some of these projects and let them work alone, okay? And they can make really, 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 really good uh, stuff, okay? Well, you can check this, okay? Check Scratch if you haven't, okay? It's pretty nice, okay? My name is Eduardo, and I will see you, I will see you next time. Thanks for watching.